what is going on guys healy here we are back with the pack and play episode number five uh, if you guys don't know a pack and play series is where you just open up packs the whole time and that's the only way you can build your team pack squads is a pack and play just so you guys know all right so in this episode we are going to probably play a couple games based off our previous history with how long games last uh, the team is looking pretty solid we do have a diamond now with charlie morton did not pull him as a diamond but we acquired him he became a diamond if you guys don't know the rules every run is a pack a home run is two packs a win is five packs a rage quit is five packs every 1000 likes is five packs also i choose one comment or a rule every single time last time it was every strikeout is a pack this time we're gonna go with down costs a comment every hit equals a pack so we should get a lot of packs today just from getting hits i'm excited for that if you want a chance to be featured in the next pack and play comment down below a rule that i should use be a little logical when thinking about them i'm trying to earn more packs not less packs we have the squad, Eddie Rosario, we have Joey Gallo, Babe Ruth, Tim Anderson, Glaber Torres, Pete Alonso, Mike Moustakis, and Schwarber. Uh, Moustakis is down on the day. Uh, same with us, Drupal Cabrera. We have Rafael Devers out there. We go with Paul DeYon. Paul DeYon might be nice. Uh, he's a lefty. We're going to go with Glaber Torres at third, Eddie Rosario at second, and then uh, Mini Minoso is going to be in the outfield again. Moustakis is going to get replaced for now. We need a left-handed bat. We'll go Devers. So, yeah, that's going to be the lineup and the bench. Also, Jake Diekman, you guys said for me to use whatever I get out of packs. Chris Sale is going to be used out of the pen. And that is good. We're looking. We're on the hunt for diamonds. We're going up against the Kershaw Knights. He has John Lester on the mound. We have Hin Jin Ryu. He has Xander Bogarts, Nick Senzel, Scott Kingry, Colton Wan, Eric Hosmer, Jason Hayward, Jay Bruce, Brian McCann. Okay, we're going up against a lefty. I need to take Ryu out of the lineup. Probably his wind up way too long. And now we are going to go with the curveball here. See if we can fool him. Wait, what? That ball should not have been hit contact. at all. Oh, we strike him out. We are going to go fastball again right here. And this one's hit deep. Minoso, he's back there. Yeah, we're going to go another change up here. Oh, and two. We get our second strikeout of the game. No, Minoso is going to be out there, though. He has solid defense. Thankful for that. Oh, no, two Gallo. Joey Gallo, this one's hit to center field. We don't get a hit. Big meat Pete. Come on. One no count now. And we're going to fly out. Oh, my God. We go hitless in the first inning. So he has three straight lefties. First one being Colton Juan, hoping to strike him out here. We do. Schwarber, this is going to be thrown to first base. We're going to go another curve. 0-2. Might be the fourth strike out of the game for Ryu. And it is. Uh, I stand corrected. I think he only has three at the moment. Are we really about to uh, not get any hits? Labor, come on, get out, get out, get out. It's off the wall. We get a hit. We're going to third base. Oh my God, that throw is close. I was hoping that would, dude, a home run. That would have been two extra packs. Anoso, he gets that one to the left side. Third baseman. What happened? Um, game log. 
Grounded out. Five unassisted? Five unassisted? I don't know what happened. We get a run, though, so that's two packs. Five unassisted. Schwarber, he gets a hit. That's our third pack of the game. Nice pitch. Tim Anderson, he is a little worse against lefties, but it's fine. Anderson, he gets that one through. That is our fourth pack already. I'll take it. If Rio could get a hit, that would be sick. Come on. Oh, that one's up the middle. 50 speed. We're going to test him. I don't know who that is in center field. The throw is off. We get a hit and a run. I don't know how many packs we have so far. I completely lost track. We'll we'll find out at the end of the game. Come on. Hit a home run. Hit a home run. Come on, Joey. Nope. Uh, we are late on it. That ball is mashed. Oh, my God. If we pulled that. So we had four hits, two runs. That is six packs. Okay. Oh, and two. We're going to go inside with another fastball. And we strike him out. Oh, and two. Do McCann. And we strike him out. Third straight fastball here to John Lester. And we strike him out. We struck out the side. Oh, immaculate inning. Nine pitches. Okay. Didn't realize I had trophies on. Damn it. He up the middle. That's our seventh pack of the game. Three and oh. Labor Torres is on deck. Babe Ruth, this one is demolished. And on a 3 0 count, Babe Ruth goes yard. Mini Minoso made a couple nice plays on defense for us. And Minoso flies out. That's going to do it for the inning. Okay. We have 10 total packs just from runs and hits. And then a home run. Yeah, 12 packs. This one up the middle. Tim Anderson can't get to it. This guy gets his first base runner on. We're going to go change up here to Senzel, trying to get him to ground out. He strikes out. Dwarber. Oh, he really went to second base. And we get him out. A strike him out, throw him out. You have to go immediately. We're just going to go fastball high and away again. And wow. He gets a base hit. It's in the corner. Babe Ruth. Tosses in. Okay. Base hit will score a run for my opponent. And it doesn't look like it is. Minoso makes the catch. We escape. Tim Anderson. He got on last time. And he gets on this time. That's going to be a double 75 speed. Easy double for Tim Anderson. Base hit now could drive him in. That's pack number 13. Ryu, he got a base hit up the middle. And so here's the pitcher now. Hunjin Ryu, the next to bat. Oh, does this drop? He can't get to it. This one's down. What's the point of going back to second base when you're halfway to third? What's the point of that? Eddie Rosario trying to go lefty lefty here. And we break our bat, and that's gonna be an out. We get two hits though. Up to 14 total packs. Jay Bruce actually has more power against lefties if this is the gold. So I have to be afraid. But no so. Can't field it. He gets on base with Jay Bruce. Let's just go fastball inside. And we strike him out. He cannot. Babe Ruth. He has our home run in this game. 3-0 count. And he hits another no doubter. That is going to be four packs. One for a run. One for a, two for a home run. And one for a hit. We're up to 18 total. And Glaber gets that one down the line. 19 total now. He's going to be on second base with 50 speed. Two and two now. And Schwarber, he grounds out. That is fine. 0 and 2. We're going to go curveball. 
been a big factor in strikeouts today. We are facing a right-handed pitcher now. And Anderson, he grounds out. We are going to bunt. And Ryu doesn't know how to put the ball in fair territory. Gallo's now up. Joey Gallo with a no doubter. That is big. Add on five more packs. Is this a rage quit? Yes, we get a rage quit in this game. So we had 11 hits, seven runs. That is 18 packs right there. And thir three home runs total. Yeah, Babe Ruth had two, Gallo had one. So add on six packs to that. That is 24 packs plus the five packs for the win and five packs for the rage quit. So that is 34 total packs for us. Gallo won for four. He had a big home run. Alonzo won for three. Babe Ruth two for three, three RBIs. Torres two for three. Warber one for three. Anderson two for three. And Ryu two for three. In my rank, yesterday I played on stream rank seasons, five games, and pitchers again, my opponents, pitchers batted five for 11 against me. It's insane how well pitchers hit in this game. So we are going to open up 30 standards, one silver pack, one gold or better pack, and then two headliners. We're hoping for big pull on the headliners success not the best jared ikov not gonna break the rotation we're looking for our first diamond pull in this pack and play series gold still aren't bad as there are still a lot of great ones out there that we can get but we are looking for mainly diamonds now in hopes of making our team even better Couple golds that I would like to see pulled. Gary Sanchez. Uh, Fernando Tatis would be cool. We get Felipe Rivero for the pen. Uh, Felipe Vasquez. I don't know if we'll use him. Chris Sale is dirty. But we have Vasquez now. He is a good lefty for the pen now. We'll take it. Salvador Perez, we already have. Did not mean to do that. Another gold player. Position player, please. And it is Eugenio Suarez. That is great. We could play him at shortstop. I think we're going to stick him at third base, though. This card is juiced. His stats are great. And he has good inside edge. So that is a good pull from or for Eugenio Suarez. So a couple good gold pulls so far. Travis Shaw, not bad. Got Shebler. We're just going to cruise through these packs. AJ Pollock, we don't need. Alberto Mondesi would be cool if we pulled him. Because he would definitely be our starting shortstop then. Jerry's Familia, he'll probably go in the pen for us. Still need a couple more right-handers in the pen. But we do have, I think, a gold. But Pan Ishek. He could be in the pen, but I don't want to use Hector Neris. I think we're using John Gant at the moment. Colin Moran. Gold player, Carlos Santana. We're using Gallo at first base. We could use Santana behind the plate. We currently have Kyle Schwarber, but Santana might be the better option right now due to his switch hitting. Still no diamonds, though. I don't know how many packs we've opened in this pack and play series so far, but we've opened up quite a bit. This guaranteed gold player. Is he going to be good? Yasmat. Oh, man. Talking about, talking about catchers. Yasmani Grandal. He is going to be our catcher now. Inside edge. Makes him amazing. He might even go up to gold. Big pull. And we have two headliners. We get a gold player. Who's it going to be? Lorenzo Kane. Ooh. He's an interesting pick for the outfield. We do have Mini Minoso out there. 
We do have uh actually we have Joey Gallo in center field. We're using Pete Alonzo at first. Ah, Lorenzo Kane's stats, not really liking. But hey, we have Lorenzo Kane for now. Diamond Paul! Let's go! Please give me a good diamond. Zero hits. This is gonna be a future stars card. Austin Riley. Austin Riley. Yes. I was thinking maybe it could have been Vlad Jr., but hey, we get our third baseman. Austin Riley. That is a big pull. 92 power versus righty. It's 95 versus lefties. Doesn't go for a lot, but we can't buy people. Oh, man. Our third baseman. We got to move Glaber back there. Eddie Rosario going to be there. Mini Minoso will be on the bench. Austin Riley is going to be our third baseman. Play left field for us, but we aren't going to do that. Tim Anderson. I am sorry, bud. Chris Davis, unfortunately, is going to be moved. Carlos Santana is going to be placed on the bench. Switch hitting. He can play catcher or third base. And, yeah, we need a switch hitter. So, the lineup is looking pretty nice. Felipe Vas or, yeah, Vasquez is there. We go Pat Neshek, though. Yeah, we'll leave it as that. I would say this is a pretty good episode. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you leave a like. Subscribe down below. This is Healy, and I'm out. Peace.